You can bet in a heartbeat that I make quality videos. Set? What's going on here? Why? If, if I mess up, then... Sounds of wind reverberate through the void. You feel cold. I never liked this place. The sooner I get out of here, the better. Being dead isn't fun. Hey, are we gonna get a move on? Or are you just gonna stand around and wait for Toriel to catch us? Uh, yeah, I'll get moving. Hey, it's fine, okay? S sorry, I'm, uh... Jeez, I understand why you're nervous. You're already acting like we lost. Again. It wasn't her fault. Don't blame her for something that couldn't be helped. <sighs> Child, have you lost the ones that you have loved? I cannot do this. I can't. Child, listen to me. Huh? Every human that leaves the ruins meets the same fate. I have seen it. Again and again. They come. They leave. They die. Foolish child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. Let us put this foolish fight aside. I am giving you this chance to offer my protection. I swear to you, this is no deception. For no children have died to my hand. Do you understand? Stay with me. I promise I can protect you. I... I'll do what's right. If I destroy that door, no monsters can harm you. You will be safe with me, my child. Toriel is sparing you. Maybe it's not such a bad idea, Frisk. Uh, I... Uh, I... I can't. Please, human. This is your final chance. I know we do not have much, but please. We can make a family here. I can protect you. Please, be a good child and go upstairs. I... I promise. I can protect you. Toriel, somewhere out there, my family is wondering where I am, when, if, I'll come home. They care about me, and I know staying here with you, it would be so much easier. But it wouldn't be fair if they were waiting for someone who wouldn't come home, and I won't give up on them. Not after all the times they've never given up on me. Want to leave so badly, just like the others. So be it. You have proven to me you are strong enough to survive. Leave now, and never return. <sighs> Why are you making this so difficult? Toriel. <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? I cannot kill even a single child. I mean, I'm sure they'd care to disagree. Bro, oh, why would you say this? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I suppose so. Huh? I am sorry, my child. My expectations, my resentment, my fear. I've bore the burden unto you. The consequences of my actions, the rules I have allowed myself to follow, 
whom I've decided to ally myself to, these are all questions I've come to think about. And, Flower, for harming you and scaring away your friends, I deeply apologize. You had only done what I would have, had I found the courage to do so. You did not deserve my ire. Please, protect them. They are a gentle child. They need guidance. An ally. But what about you, Toriel? I shall do what I must. What I believe should have been done long ago. However, this is a personal matter, and it should not concern you. After all, I believe you two have more pressing matters to be concerned about. And you, Frisk, be a good child and leave this place. Find your family. I am sure they feel very lucky to have a wonderful child like you. Farewell, my child. Well, we did it, Flowey. We made it through the ruins. It feels so... strange. Like so much has happened in this short time that we've spent together. I wonder what else has changed. But how are you feeling, Flowey? I... I... I need time. Seeing her... It makes me sad. We should get going, I think. You ready? Friends till the end. Okay? Ruins end.